Criminal Justice Academy. WIS reporter Jalen Tart breaks down what he found in those documents and what he learned about who's next in charge of campus security. In my hand are the police training files for former SC State Police Chief Timothy Taylor and former Captain Jablonski Green. These contain details about their tenure at SC State. I reached out to the university spokesperson, Sam Watson. He confirms Taylor and Green are no longer employed at South Carolina State University. According to the South Carolina Criminal Justice Academy file, Taylor began working for the university on October 20th, 2021. Taylor was fired on Friday, April 12th. The reason cited in the documents was leadership alignment by the university. His firing happened two weeks after an officer-involved shooting on campus that injured a suspect. Neither the university nor SLED have released the name of the officer who fired at the suspect. According to the Criminal Justice Academy file, Jablonski Green began working at the university on June 1, 2022, and retired on April 17. Both SC State and Green were recently named in a lawsuit filed by three former campus security officers alleging gender-based discrimination in a hostile work environment. Taylor was not named in the lawsuit. Spokesperson Sam Watson tells me the university is searching for a full-time police chief to replace Taylor. In the meantime, Watson says Captain Africa Wells, who has been an officer for SC State since October of last year, will temporarily take over Taylor's duties, but has not been named the interim chief. Reporting in the newsroom, Jalen Tart, WIS News 10.